my name is Katie. And I'm Dominique. Welcome to Suitland High School, home of the Rams. We have an amazing CVPA program. CVPA stands for Creative Visual Performing Arts. And today I'll be showing you what it's like to be a CVPA major here at Suitland High School. I will be walking you through all things vocal and dance. I will be showcasing TV production and theater majors. And I will be taking a peek into what it's like to be an orchestra, band, and theater major. I'm Kayla Durham, I'm a senior here. Uh, I'm in the visual arts department and I major in sculpture and photography. Okay, so what has your overall experience at Suitland been like so far? Since my freshman year? Mm -hmm. It's been pretty cool, it's really interesting. There's a lot of different people here, a lot of different personalities and a lot of things that go on here. For me personally, it's been pretty cool. I'm a calm person, so. Mm -hmm. Um, how do you think going here to Suitland has given you an advantage as opposed to like if you'd never come here and you'd just be trying to do your art on your own? Here in the art program, they challenge you way more than any other art program. Um, we're a highly respected art program and highly ranked. So um, we're kind of getting some of the best education from the best people. So do you think you could have gotten the same opportunities and same kind of education at any other school? For regular studies, I mean, I think it's kind of the same at a lot of high schools, but for the arts here, not at all. I think we have a lot of special opportunities and tools here to actually learn. Mm -hmm. We have a whole dark room, a lot of schools don't have that. Without CVPA, I probably would not have grown as much as a musician, and taking music theory is very key when you're doing anything that has anything to do with music, so it's really just a great thing that we have such a wonderful program. Um, is this something that you want to do for the rest of your um, yes, I definitely want to stay involved in the arts for the rest of my life. I want to venture out to the world of theater, but I'm always going to be interested in music and playing my instrument. Okay. I think that's all the questions I have. I'm a senior and I'm in the orchestra department. 
So, how has your time at Sulin High School been so far? So far, I guess you can say, well, I'm a senior, so I'm ready to get out, but it's been really, actually, really great. I've learned so much from the orchestra department. I've had many opportunities. i played with many people and many, at many gigs, and I'm so thankful to be in this orchestra. Okay. Um, without CVPA, how do you think you would have done playing your instrument on your own? I feel like I wouldn't be as talented, not to sound very cocky or anything, but I wouldn't have the technique I have now. I wouldn't be able to have the experience I have now. Mm -hmm. So the CVPA orchestra department has given me that experience I needed. Mm -hmm. um, compared to the other majors, how do you think orchestra may be different? Well, we're better. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, we're very, I guess we're very strict in our craft. We're very based, like we're t based on technical features. We um, work together more. Well, every music department does, but we're more known for working together. And I guess that's it. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. <laughs>
So what's your preferred like dance style, like hip hop, jazz, ethnic? Have you done any profi high profile shows? Mm -hmm. No. And do you think you get the best training possible here at Sweden? Yes. Production. We learn how to use cameras and edit and you know different parts and aspect of the work production like TV production like what's behind all your shows like you see your TV and your favorite actors but after your actors like what's behind the camera what do they do and that's what we learn here. Do you have a specific role in TV production? Um, I'm more of talent so again I'm kind of like front screen but I'm not your actor I'm like a news station talent so like a desk like this I'll sit behind it and we have some giant cameras in the back there and I'll sit with the script and I'll read you the morning news. Um, other than that, I'm like an editor and cameraman. You know, um, kind of flip-flop roles a lot, but I'm generally most likely talent. Um, what's your favorite project that you've done so far? Um, my favorite project has to be, we did a project about grief. And it had to be a silent film because he was trying to, our teacher, Mr. McGee, was trying to show us how music really affects a piece because music really ties all together. If you look at all the shows you watch and you just hear soft music in the background, it really adds it together because it adds to the suspense and ambiance, whether you're paying attention or not. So um, I did a silent piece called Souls, and it was just about two lovers who, can't, who couldn't be together, you know? And um, it was just the music was just kind of like, you could feel their pain, you could kind of grieve with them because you see how happy they were together and then when they separated, it was just like, oh. Um, how long has TV production been active? TV production's been here now for four years. It just started up again a couple of years ago. It ended in about 2005 because it was a thing, and then less and less kids started coming to it. Um, it started up again as a, um, not a major, but a um, Votech class. And it still is a Votech class, but you have majors and then you have vocational students who often we work together a lot. There's not much of a big difference, but majors get to know a little more in depth about it because we have fifth period and we probably have extra classes. But at the same time, if you come here in a vocational class, she won't know. Well, thank you for sitting and talking. All right, no problem. Nice seeing you, Julia. Nice to you. Hi, my name's Dominique and I'm here with... Preston Jones. And what grade are you in? I'm in the ninth. And he's in the studio of Mr. Mitzel. All right. So, as a freshman, was it hard to adjust to the fast pace here at Suitland High School? Yeah, it was. Um, when I first came in, the first day when I came into uh, Mr. Boucher's room, and I did not expect to hear like amazing voices. Like it's really beautiful. Hello, my name is Trakia Perkins. I am in the studio of, of Dr. Madeline Miski, and today I will be singing "Knocked in Time." by Frank Schubert. Do you, think, do you think that your voice lessons have had a large improvement on your vocal development? Definitely. 
like I'm I'm able to pronounce um, uh, with diction better and um, more correctly. Do you believe that what we do here requires great discipline and skill? Yeah, because you gotta stay focused. That's the main thing that uh, he says. But that that is the main thing, stay focused. And. If you were to attend a different performing arts school, do you think they'll have the same opportunities and resources as they have here at Suitland High School? Definitely not. Like, there's a lot of opportunities um, here at Suitland. That's what I think.
Thank you.